Understanding Sheltered Waters, a dive into language and meaning. Hello, and welcome to our English language learning series. Today, we're going to explore the phrase, sheltered waters. This term is not just about the sea or the ocean, but it carries a deeper meaning, both literally and metaphorically. So, let's set sail and navigate through the calm and serene world of sheltered waters. Sheltered waters refers to a part of a sea, ocean, or lake that is protected from strong winds, waves, and currents, making it a safe and calm area. Imagine a small, quiet bay shielded by a curve of land or a harbor with breakwaters preventing the rough sea from coming in. These are perfect examples of sheltered waters. They are safe havens for boats and ships, providing a tranquil environment away from the open, turbulent sea. Metaphorically, sheltered waters can describe a peaceful, protected, and stable environment in life or a specific situation. When someone says they are in sheltered waters, it often means they are in a phase of their life where they feel secure, without any immediate threats or challenges. It can also imply a protective environment where someone can grow and develop without facing the harsher aspects of life directly. Let's see how sheltered waters can be used in sentences. 1. Literal usage. The fishermen prefer to anchor their boats in the sheltered waters of the bay, especially when the weather forecast predicts a storm. 2. Metaphorical usage. After years of struggle and hardship, he finally found himself in sheltered waters with a stable job and a loving family. Understanding the context is key to grasping the full meaning of this phrase, whether it's used to describe a physical location or a state of being. And that's a wrap on sheltered waters. Whether you're navigating the literal tranquil bays and harbors or seeking the metaphorical calm in your life, remember that understanding such phrases enriches your language and communication skills. We hope you found this journey through the calm, sheltered waters of the English language enlightening and enjoyable. See you in the next video, and keep exploring the depths of language.